you are out there in San Diego and you're looking to get into the turnkey investment space, you're going to want to pay attention to what we're doing today, right? Because today I'm working for a client of mine. His name is Juan. And of course, folks, he's from San Diego. What if I was like, yo, my client Juan from Boise, Idaho. <laughs> you feel like, what the hell is this dude name dropping San Diego for? No, no, no. No, he's from San Diego, like I'm sure a lot of you watching the show are. And uh, he come to me, he comes to my company because we help investors, primarily investors from California, invest in the highest, most profitable cash flow real estates across the USA, right? Areas where the landlord-tenant laws aren't as wacky as they are in California. And Juan, I think you're really going to dig the one I got for you today. So I'm going to go over the whole shebang on a line-by-line -line basis right now. This is your show. This is the show where I work for you directly, taking your needs. I'm going through the MLS, and I'm trying to find the best possible deal for you guys, put down 25%. That's the perfect way to buy this. That's why real estate investing is the greatest industry in the world. Welcome to the show, folks. Your boy Jay Wise here, ready, ready to help y'all make that cash flow, right? Turnkey real estate, but the smarter way, right? Instead of buying a distressed property, selling it to you at a premium, I work for you to help you buy great assets like this one. 4579 Broadview Road, Cleveland. Just hit the market. One day on the market. Price point, 139 Now, the Cleveland market, one of the most popular turnkey markets in the U.S. of A, folks. You need to understand the market. You need to understand what you're getting. So I got some resources for you below. Number one, the ultimate guide to grading Cleveland neighborhoods. Check that out. I graded every neighborhood on an A to F scale. A, a lot of owner-occupied, incredibly low risk, incredibly high pricing. F, the opposite. A lot of rentals, uh, very, very high risk, very, very low prices, okay? Depending on what investment strategy you're utilizing, uh, you know, each of those neighborhood classes will probably provide you uh, better or worse opportunities. For long-term buy and hold, I like to be kind of in the middle, C grade, which is exactly what this is. Second resource I have for you is a video on the new lead paint laws in the city of Cleveland. Watch that. That has changed the way investing in Cleveland is working. This particular property is not lead certified. However, it will not be a big deal. Nothing you really need to worry about. Why? Because the two biggest pain points when you get homes lead certified are exterior wood siding and old wood windows. That's where people run into the thing. When we have to get their properties lead certified for the first time, almost 95% of the cost associated with that is going to be in replacing the windows and like encapsulating the old wood siding with either aluminum or vinyl. Well, guess what? If you can't tell, this bad boy right here is brick. So this thing is head and shoulders above a lot of the properties in the city of Cleveland. As a matter of fact, last time I checked the numbers, only 7,000 out of 80,000 rental units in Cleveland were lead certified. You guys got to do your due diligence on this. The problem with that is that means there's 73,000 non-lead certified units in Cleveland, and a lot of realtors and investors don't know about it, right? So you might buy a property not understanding you got a $40,000 lead cert coming up, right? Because the seller didn't know about it or they didn't tell you about it. You just bought it. And then, bam, six months later, the city's like, yo, do this or you're getting building code violations. Uh, long shot, but technically you could go to jail. Uh, I've never seen anybody go to jail for building code violations, but they are minor misdemeanors, right? In addition, they will prevent you uh, from actually evicting your tenant. So your tenant would be stealing from you, and there ain't jack shit you could do about it, right? So that's why it's very important to do your due diligence on the properties you're buying, a la this show, folks. That's what I'm here to help you do. And this one, like I said, brick, already got vinyl windows. This is the kind of asset you want, right? This is standing above the rest because you ain't going to run into a bunch of lead-based paint certification costs. It's going to be a very simple process for you. Now, we got two tenants in here both paying below market rent, right? This is 2022 up, updated electric panels. That's not what I like to see. It's 2022, folks. Uh, the particular seller who put these folks in there, I think they missed the mark, right? Because they're only paying 675 and 600 
That may have been cool like 10 years ago, but dude, today these are $825 a month units, right? So long term, what you're looking at here, $1,650 in rent, $19,800 scheduled to come in, right? After you factor in your fixed and variable expense estimates, I anticipate long term you pulling down about $8,300 a year. And that's with my team handling the management, folks. We do everything for you. Property management, maintenance, construction, insurance. We insure properties all over Ohio. If you're a landlord, you own a property in Ohio, hit us up. I could almost guarantee you we could lower your premium, right? There's two ways to make more money in real estate. Increase your income or decrease your costs. I'm helping you increase your income by showing you how to get properties, and I'm going to help you decrease your costs by lowering your insurance costs, folks. That is what I do. That's why we don't invest in Bitcoin, folks, because rent is due. This is how you become a millionaire, folks. You don't become a millionaire trading Bitcoin like a bunch of freaking jerk-off kids sitting in their basement. Not even their basement. It's their mom's basement. Let's face it. Eating Cheetos. Got Cheetos in their freaking beers. They got you pouring on on the other screen. It's, it's sad, really. What we're doing, folks, is making money for real. Now, another thing I got to help you with, though. 139000 is the price point that they are asking for this. As I said... This ain't normal turnkey where I own it and I'm selling it to you. I'm not going to pitch you on paying 139 I don't want you to pay 139 I think the correct price for this is 130 So I will go to bat for you. I will negotiate on your behalf. My job is to fight that seller down to 130 because I believe that's the right price point. At 130 I anticipate this long term kicking off about a 10.3%. Cash on cash return, folks, this makes a lot of sense. I highly suggest we put in our offer, build up our portfolios quickly. I mean, I just read today the basis points went up, like, again, right? Like, oh, dude, 20, 26 or something base. It's going up like crazy, folks. We got to get in there and grab all this financing uh, before they just continue raising those rates, right? There is no time like the present. Let's go. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Holton Wise TV for more financial information, education, and entertainment.